Hello, welcome to Higher Ground Gaming. Today we're going to do another episode from Moonlighter, the role-playing game that we sponsored off of Kickstarter. Um, just got released a couple of days ago. Uh, got a couple of videos up on it now. We thought we'd do another one. So, without further ado, let's get this game underway. We got Mr. Brody over here. And hopefully he's not in the way where he's at there. I noticed last time he was kind of in the way of the buttons there, so hopefully that will be a better position for him. So, alright, so let's get this game going. And we did play a little bit into the game um, from the last video to accumulate a little bit more cash and um, as well as some more, uh, some more items in the dungeons. So a little bit of grinding there, so we we'll get ourselves advanced a little bit into it. And that's where we'll start off here. So having a good time with it. Just take a little bit of time to load here. Not sure if it's our connection or the actual game itself. Probably our connection. And it just got released a little while, a couple of days ago. So, so still are three little little bugs in it, but nothing nothing major, nothing game breaking. Seems to play pretty smoothly. We did look, uh, download the manual, and look at that. Not really much, a lot of information in the manual. Um, nothing that we didn't really know. All right, come on, load. There we go. So we'll wake up for another day here. Alright, so we got a few items here. We're going to go fill our table up here. Let's see. What else we got here? We are going to... We've already got a glass lens up there. We've got a whetstone. Maybe that's for sharpening items. And we have a crystal rock. So let's get one of these right here. There's some fabric out there. Sold that for a hundred last time. So let's go go for a hundred. Yeah, Mr. Brody is kind of in the way here. So let's see if we can, there we go, move him down here. That's a, oops, now we lost him. I lost him on my screen here, but I think he's still in, this, in the picture there. All right, so we got our items here. So let's go open up our shop for the day. So shopkeeper by day, adventurer by night. We have our first customer here. Looks like he wants to look out the window there. She does. And we got our first sale. So we sell the piece of fabric there. Oh, no, the uh, lenses. So we need 50 gold there. So we got our gold up to... Over 5,000, which is one of the achievements in the game. Step right up. Actually, let's, uh, all right. So let's put another lens in there. So, okay, and another piece of fabric down there. Keep those items free. I wonder if later, if you might be able to expand your shop here and have more than just the four items there. See if we sell that piece of fabric there for a hundred. Okay, very good. Oh yeah, we already got a place. Another piece of fabric. The fabric's selling like hotcakes. We'll have to keep an eye out for that. The shop is booming. Now we can list more than one of these at a time, but it puts it sells them as a group. I think so. Can't really. Actually, hold on. What do we got here? Right trigger. Does that mean we got? Uh, oh, I see. We can. Oh, that just changes what we do in our book here. Oh, so we can keep track of our sales here. It looks like these are items that we've sold so far. I'm guessing. Sure, exactly what this is. 
Maybe those are items that we can create and everything. So these are items that we haven't found yet. So tons of items there. So let's see here. So I think these are items we haven't discovered yet. So we can keep track of all this stuff. Uh... So yeah, none of this has been identified yet. Hmm. So let's see what... Let's see what... Let's see if we can go over to that right page over here. Selling and reactions. Okay. So what's that? Okay. Anyway, I'm not sure exactly what that means in there. I think it's just how they react to our prices and stuff. So, alright. Sell some more lenses here. Let's keep those lenses going. Yeah, that's definitely one of our best sellers there. We don't have any more fabric, so we ran out of that. Oops. I'm going to have to hire an employee here to keep up these sales. Right, let's put up one of these. Uh, these sell pretty good too, the uh, iron bars. Doesn't like that. Maybe we'll lower this item here. Uh, let's see here. So we'll lower that one to say I don't know, 150. Try that. And we sell those lenses. Those lenses. Pretty much everybody wants those, and that must be a decent price. Still too high, it looks like, at least for her, on that bread-looking thing there. Oh, we sold the iron bar here. Let's get another one of those up. Actually, let's list one of these right here, the uh, water spheres. They'll sell pretty good, too. Still appear to be a little bit high. Oops, we're selling our items out here. Looks like it's just about the end of the day here. Uh, well, let's get a couple items back out there. So let's so put our last lens up there. And we'll list, uh, let's list one of these here. Our ancient pots. Looks like these are our last customers here as so we're getting. Oh, no, another one comes in. Uh, it's maybe a little too high here. Let's go a little bit lower on the uh, crystal rock here. Let's go 140. Let's try that. Oh, sell our pot here. All right. Last sale of the day here. So overall, really good day here, I think. Let's see what we made. So these are our sales for the day. $780, not bad, 14 items. 10 of those teeth stones there we sold. Oh, we sold them in bunches, that's what we did, okay. Alrighty. All right, so let's restock and go adventuring. So let's see, what are we going to put out here for now? Actually, let's maybe put some rich jelly out here. Oh, we haven't sold much of that, so... Yeah. Let's get rid of that. We don't want that. That's only five. Alright, um... I think we're going to leave those open for now. Just in case we get some good stuff adventuring, which I'm sure we will. Alright, let's go off into our dungeon here. Get our backpack here. Go back in here. 
So we got to work eventually on upgrading our armor and whatnot that we have on, and our weapon probably. Uh, I haven't seen how to do that yet. I think what we got to do too is uh, maybe tomorrow, instead of opening the shop, or we might go to visit the blacksmith or some of the other vendors in the city. As we are saving, it saves after you, every time you go into a dungeon or go into your house or leave a dungeon, I think it automatically saves, so that's nice. Yeah, definitely a little bit long on these loading times. Come on. And it might be a little bit longer too because I am uploading a, uh, a diamond mine baseball video from the all-time low League. So let's see here. Let's go over to the left here. Let's see, make sure we got our weapons. Yeah, we got our weapons loaded. Alright, so this was just pretty much as we lock up here. <laughs> Give it a second here. Um, okay. Pretty sure it will load in just a second. It's just taking a little extra time here. We might have to do our control alt delete to Let's see here. We definitely seem to have locked up once again. Oh, there it goes. Usually freeze it up there. Did not seem to work this time. There it goes. Okay. So why do our tools keep disappearing? Oh, there it goes. Of course, now it now it'll show up there. Chambers full of precious stone are left untouched. Our rooms and chests holding our most basic tools keep vanishing. Okay, so let's look at looks show you what this is right here. Um, we did find this other item here. Um, in the bottom left hand corner there. We can actually um, if we put the items here in this little thing down below here, the merchant mirror. They'll turn to items into a small amount of gold. So if you're stuck in a dungeon and don't have enough money, we have plenty, but if you do, it'll convert some of your items to gold, so it'll help you get out of that dungeon. Okay. Let's see what's going on over here. And these are randomly generating. So let's see here. Okay. Alright. Take a little bit too much damage on that. Oh, we don't want to fall. So we're going to lose some of these items. Oh, we got most of them. Alright, so now we can open it once we've cleared the dungeon here and uh, get a couple of broken swords. These actually sell pretty good. And this one. Foundry rests. I don't know if we got any of those. So our bag is probably probably should have emptied some of our bag before we went in the dungeon here. But we'll get rid of if we can stack this right here. No? There we could. Yeah we can, okay. That's what I thought. Uh something else we could stack here. Yeah, I think oops. I think this we can stack right here. So let's stack some of this. Alright, now we have a couple of empty spots here. Uh, we're not going to be spending too much more time in here. Since we're almost out of health here. Oh, yeah. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh. So we may not have wanted to come in here. Although we 
kind of did defeat those pretty easily. Oh! Just trying to make sure we don't get touched by that. We are definitely gonna exit as soon as we kill this guy. There we go. Alright. So now the door reopens and let's get out of this place. Let's go down to our exit here. Alright, so we get some more items to sell here. Oh, there's Mr. Brody showing up again on my screen here. So this is a summary of what we did uh, to the right here, the monsters that we killed and everything. And let's go to town. So it's probably still the middle of night, so we'll go in and uh, get ourselves some sleep here and then uh, we will open up the shop this time. We'll, uh, well actually it is daytime. We spent a lot of time there. So, all right. So, actually, let's uh, let's go get rid of a couple of our common items here. So let's get rid of a stack of uh, ooh, I don't know. So let's just get rid of st a stack of these. And a stack of these, I guess. Oops. Oop. Not sure if there's an easy, quick button to do a lot of these. There probably is. Just not sure exactly what it is offhand. All right. So we get a little bit of an empty space here. Let's stack this up too. Not sure why I didn't stack these up in the first place, but. All right, so we get a couple open stacks there, so let's go. Let's go visit some of our vendors here today. So do a little exploring to the town here. What's this place? That is not a shop there. Uh, is this a shop? Can't go into this place. Uh, see what this guy is. Have you found any new culture artifacts in the dungeons? Will. I always found it fascinating on how the items we find in the dungeons appear to be from entirely different civilizations with unique cultures. Okay. So this guy is. Arnoka may not be as prosperous as it used to be, but many still visit to pick up a souvenir from the Golem Dungeon. Possibly even one from the Closed Dungeon, so if we are lucky. Yeah. We have to, I think we have to get a key for those to go in those. So it's this right here. I'm trying to find out if we can... Ooh, what's that? No. I'm trying to see. That's as far as we can go south. Let's see who you are. I saw you in the Golem Dungeon earlier. Found anything mysterious? Alright, here's a shop. I think we can go in this one. Oh, maybe not. So I know there's a blacksmith in the town. So this, can we interact with the well? No. What's this guy? Ma Massa. Will, can we play a tag next time I stop by your shop? Sure, why not? So, 
apparently you can't go in any of these shops, which I thought you might be able to. Maybe, oh, maybe this one. It's got a little quest icon on here. So, investments, town. Alright, here we go. So, let's see here. Do you feel the dungeon's too hard? Tired of your weapon? I can solve that if you bring me enough money and materials. A forge to be reckoned with. Oh, that's, I think he's a blacksmith. Balkan's Forge. And the wooden hat is a brute force getting you nowhere then to visit the wooden hat to find potions, enchantments for this and that. I think this guy is our competition. Le Retailer. Tired of looking for items in dungeons? Leave it to a job to others to come to Le Retailer where you find the finest assortments in Renoka. Because life's complicated enough. Okay, so I think we have to pay to open up these. So let's try this guy. Okay, let's, uh, so I think, so, ah, so we opened him up, so let's, uh, so he's going into his shop now. Okay, so we had to pay money to reopen it. Ah, now he's open, okay. Okay, we're kind of stuck now. Ah, oh, there we go. So let's go check out this guy now. He must be Will. The one who requested my forge, okay. My name is... So I think this is, might be where we can craft stuff. If it's a weapons or armor you seek, Vulcan's Forge is the place. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, so it looks like we can forge items here. Let's see here. We get Mr. Brody here blocking the... So let's see if we can move him over up here, I guess, for now. Okay, so let's see here. So we can make this up. Uh, we need... These are the items we need for each one. Okay, this is armor. Okay. Oh, so we do... Oh, oh, we have to go back and get some of these items here, I think. Let's see if there's anything else we can do here with what we got. Okay. So, okay, so we're gonna have to start collecting some of our items to, I'm gonna go back and get some of these uh, rock looking things there, which I have over here in storage, I think. I think we have them for sale, but is this our shop over here? I think so. Okay. All right, so let's do some crafting here. Uh, so where was that item? A second. How did it say we didn't? Oh, maybe we didn't have enough. All right, let's go back and collect some of these. So maybe we just didn't have enough of it. That might have been it. All right. Okay. So I think next time what we're going to do is, whoops, is we're going to go craft some, uh, I mean, I collect some items, and this time we won't open the shop for a little while. Because if we get enough money right now... Yeah, that's it. That's why. Because we just only own a couple of them. So is there anything we can craft? I don't think so. Let's see. Just check all the items here. Let's check this right here. Yeah, none of those. Okay, so we're going to have to... I think we're going to have to use some of our broken... No, maybe not. Uh, yes, we gotta use the broke. Oh, we, we need five of the broken swords. We only have one. Okay. So let's go collect some more items. And actually, let's uh let's open up our other shop here and see what the other person has to offer here. Town. So let's open up the wooden hat here. So, potions and enchantments, okay. Alright, so she's gonna open up her shop. Okay, alright, so her shop is open now. Question is, where am I? Oh, there. Okay, alright. We don't wanna open up our competition shop yet. 
We want to see what she's got to offer. Eris. Customer. My apologies, it's just this book. It's so good. Okay, yes, Weaver and Potion. Okay, come to the wooden hat when you need a potion or enchantment. What you want to craft today. Okay. So let's see if we have enough. Oh, here we go. So we, ah, uh, this is what we want. We want to craft some health potions, definitely. So let's tap on this. Can we do more at one? Let's just do the one for now. Okay. Alright, so. Looks like we don't have enough for the big ones. So let's just craft. Let's craft a few more of these. Let's see if we can. I'm not sure if we can do more than one at a time, but. Just craft. We'll brew a few more of them. We'll get five. Because these are going to allow us to stay in the dungeons a little bit longer. Alright, so we got five potions. Let's see what else she has to offer here. Enchantments. Alright, so we don't really have any. I don't think we have any armor. Oh, what's this? Oh, okay, so we can enchant our swords and shields. Let's try that. So that, that'll increase our power, our sword there from 20 to 27. So, yeah, we definitely want to do that. So we're down to 3,000 gold now. Okay, yeah. So I think we used all up all our enchantments there. Oh, so we could go to 34 once we get a few more of those red, red things there. So we're going to hold on to those for enchantments. Alright, so, so we got some potions and upgraded our sword there, so it's a little tougher. So let's go, uh, let's go open up our shop for a little while. I think we still have some time left. Maybe not there. I forgot where our shop was. Maybe, I think it's up here, actually. Oops. Right, I think we still have some time to make some cash here. Oops, the Brody's in the way again. Uh, I guess we'll just put it down here, put them down here. That should work. Alright. Alright, so let's see here. Let's see. So we want to hold on to those broken swords there. Probably don't want to sell too much here. But I want to hold on to the uh, foundry rest there. We do have plenty of these things, so let's uh, let's try to sell another one of these. Okay. And these right here, we want to. Stack these. Okay. All right, I think we're good here now. Oh, actually. Let's, uh, let's continue to lower this a little bit. It's still too high over there. are fairly easy to find so we'll uh, continue to sell those um, as well as this right here we'll lower that one a little bit more all 
All right, so now we got a couple of sh other shops open, so that's good. It gives us a little bit more to do here. Still thinks that's high. Still too high. Seems to be a little high for that item, so let's, uh, let's go down to whoops. Go down to 25 on that one. Just some more wheeling and dealing here. Yeah, maybe it is 100 for that one. Pretty sure we did sell one of those for 100. Maybe not though. Come on. Alright. Got more items out there. Oh, looks like they did pick up our rock. Good. Did sell that for a hundred, that's good. So low, I mean does that mean we're selling it too low? Alright, so we're gonna get more stuff up here. We can't buy it if we don't have it up here. What else? What else? What else? Five of those, so that's like those are just stick cells, they're fairly common. So we'll get rid of some of those sticks we got there. Those should sell pretty easily, I would think. No, yes, they noticed it's the sticks. Come on, that's a deal five sticks for ten gold. We're running out of quality items here. All right. Last sale of the day. All right, so we should be able to stay in the dungeons a little bit longer now. Didn't really sell much, but it's all right. 440. We'll take it. Alright, so let's go in the dungeon here. Now we have some of our potions here. Now, do I have the potions loaded up in a hotkey? That's the thing. I think I do, but let's, uh, let's just check to be sure here. Okay, uh, I think we, yeah, right trigger is a potion, I think. All right, I think we're all set with our potions loaded up now. All right, so we should be able to last a little bit longer in here now. So definitely playing this game, we've gotten more into the itch of uh, wanting to play more role-playing games. We've playing some. Divinity Original Sin 1 and 2, playing some of that, uh, as well as some other RPGs that we like to play. Um, we've been playing a uh, Windward, which is a nice sailing pirate type game, but mostly trading and 
exploring and sailing. Nice relaxing game there. So let's see, let's go to the top this time. Alright. Alright, not much going on in this one. Let's go over here now. Ooh. Not my whoa, whoa. Not my favorite types of ones here, so. It's R2. No, R1. L1. R2. Oh, L2. Oh. Exciting yet? Oh, almost forgot our lenses. That those are good sellers. Um, where did we come in from? The no, yeah, we came in from the left. So we, should, we probably should check this pot just in case. Sometimes there's potions inside there. All right, let's see what we got up here. There's one guy. Check the pods here. Come on, baby. Gotta watch his. All right. Ooh, is that a? Ooh, we got some good items here. Let's see what we got here. Oh, we should have emptied our backpack. All right, some golem cores. That's good. Oh, I think I know we need this hardened steel to make probably some blacksmith stuff. So that's good. And then crystallized energy. I'm sure that that'll come in handy. Let's see if there's anything we can. Let's get rid of these sticks here. We don't really need these sticks. How do we uh, drop it? Actually, let's just convert that into cash. There we go. Uh, actually, okay, there. Anything else we can stack up? I don't think so. We got a couple open slots now, so that's good. Uh, all right. Oh yeah, we want to try to get more of these too. I think. Um. Empowering crystals. I think we needed that for enchantments or something. Alright, so let's go up here. So we can go a little further now. Still have to be careful. Right. A little bit of damage there, but not too bad. Pot up here. Not often anything in these, but it's worth looking anyway. Sometimes you can find potions and stuff. Alright, so we can't go any further up here. Because we just knock over. Alright, uh, I think we can go to the right here. I think we want to check that out. Not been there yet. Ooh. Hello. Ah, he didn't have anything on him. It's kind of a waste. Now, I'm not sure if we're getting experience points as we do this. Uh, definitely need to. See, have we been up here yet? Yes. We definitely need to get some more better armor. So, okay. Ooh, hello. Okay. You kidding me, really? Oh, that was close. So we want to right trigger, right trigger again. No, 
now. I guess it might be a cooldown time. Yeah, we still have... We didn't even use the potion, but... Oh, we still have five left. Oh, good. We found some more of these. We definitely want some more of those. So I think we have enough of this one now to make an item or... Hold on. Thought we grabbed them all. Maybe we can't grab more than one. Yeah, we can. Okay. What did we... Oh. We switched them? I thought we... Uh... Hold on. Let's try this again. Oh. So it switches them. Why doesn't it... Why doesn't it... Oh, okay, that's why. Can we not fit more than three? Apparently not. Alright, so we gotta get rid of something. Let's get rid of these sticks here. We don't need those. Oh, oh, oh. Probably should have sold the sticks, but oh well. So let's move these. So maybe we can only stack three of those at a time. Oop. There we go. That might be it. Oh, we got another item here. Hmm. I don't think this needs to be in a certain. All right, so we need to sell some stuff here. Let's uh, let's get rid of this. Uh, which jelly? I don't know if we need any of those though. These are fairly common to get, so let's sell a stack of those. Oh. Now, I th these don't have to be in a certain spot, so I'll move these up here. Oops. Did I replace? Oh, I don't need okay. So let's stack these right here. And let's just sell that one. It's only one. Okay, so now we have... S yeah, I know what it is. Whoa. Oh, uh, this was right or left. Oops. So I think this will work right here. Yes. Okay. Alright. Guess we could. Let's just sell these. Okay. Alright, so I think we're good here. Alright. Alright. Uh, now where do we come? I think we gotta go up here. Actually, let's try another. So I don't know if we can we not use another potion. Let's see. Oh, there we go. X. Oops. Which one was X? Oh, there we go. I'm sorry. Okay. All right. Oh, so it's not that red stuff that we need. Alright, we took way too much damage from this guy. Get out of here. Oh my goodness. Um. Oh, woo! Guy almost got us. That's not good. Can we? Ooh, that was way too close for comfort. All right. Woo! All right. Uh, check our bag here. Looks like we got a bunch of junk in here we don't need. Um, let's get rid of that. All right, let's see what's in this zone here. This, oh yeah, this is the Golem Dungeon Part 2, I think. So we're definitely being able to go a little further in these dungeons with the uh, 
healing potion, so it's definitely well worth it. Yeah, is this an item right here? Oh, did I break it? No! Looks like a sword. Did I break the sword? No, nope, guess not. Alright, so we gotta be careful in here. Yeah, these guys. Oh, oh yeah, good stuff. That was a good stuff. Okay, let's not play around. Oh, we can't. So I think as long as there's a monster alive in here, we can't go to our backpack, so that kind of stinks. Okay. So I think now we can, so let's, uh, don't take any chances here. Let's... Oh, here we go. Oh, baby. That's what we needed. Can we stack them higher? I hope we can. Uh, this is one of those weird limitation things. I think so, yeah. Alright, we don't really need that. Let's just sell that. Definitely having some inventory issues here. Hold on. What's that? Water lamp. Destroys one item curse in the direction shown when placed. Say what? <laughs> so, cursed item thing. Huh. Interesting. Alright. Um. Alright. Let's just try to free up some space here. sell a stack of these. We already have a stack, so. Okay. We're definitely going to have to use our inven inventory a little bit more uh, storage back at the house now. Okay, what's this? Destroys one item in direction shown upon returning to town. Oh, that's not good. Destroys one item cause... Oh, okay. So we got to watch out for this because we don't want to... Boy. Well, that stinks. So these cursed items. Definitely, we want some more of these. Well, I think maybe if we put this in the bottom, it won't do that, maybe? Maybe it... What? Oh, we can't put it there. Uh, we can't put it there. Oh boy, so what item do we not want? <laughs> well, that stinks. Alright, so I think what I'm going to do is use my last potion here. Okay, so now I can put... That's going to destroy those, though. Maybe if we get rid of them, we sell them, it won't destroy it. Or is it going to move to the next item? Yeah, okay. So if we leave it blank, that's... Yeah. We're good. Okay. Can we put it... Can we put more items on top of that? They still want to take those. Oops. No, I sold them by accident. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, well. Alright, so here's what we're going to do. Uh, oh boy. Okay, let's replace this item. With this right here. So let's just leave that empty. Okay, let's try that now. Okay, so I think we're good as long as we leave those empty. So we're just gonna... Uh, I'd like to go a little bit more exploring since we use that... Oh, this is not good. Alright, so there weren't really any items in here. Alright, so let's just head back to town now. We don't want to risk it anymore here. Yeah, 
let's just let's just head back to town. Got a full backpack here. So that was a pretty productive trip there. Very happy with that. And man, we've almost gone an hour in the video, so it's definitely time flies when you're having fun. So let's go back and uh Let's go visit some of our. I think so. Now I think we're good here. So I didn't destroy any of the items. And we got some more items we can craft some stuff here. So let's go to the. Uh, find out where this guy is. I think he's over here. Yeah. Let's see if we can craft something now. Maybe some armor. Okay. Uh, we shouldn't have sold that cloth stuff we had, but oh well. We didn't know it at the time. Uh, here we go. So now we can craft ourselves a big sword. Hmm. What about this? Can't do those. So. Oh, I think we need to craft this in order to get other stuff later on. So. Okay, let's, uh, let's at least craft this. Are you sure you want to craft the training big sword? Yes. Aha! So now, okay, so now we can use that once we find some, uh, whatever that middle item is there. I don't know if we've seen any of that yet. And this one, we need another one item there. So we can upgrade it. Wow, it's a big improvement there. 62 for this one, and 50, and then we can keep, wow. So we definitely want to upgrade our items here. But let's see if there's anything else we can do. Oh, do we have any more of those rods there? Because then we can create a spear. And I think we can sell it. We can sell that stuff in our shop too. So let's see if we have any more of those rods back in our humble abode here. And I don't know if we did. May not have. No. No, we don't. Oh, so we're gonna definitely want to get some more of those rods. So let's open up our shop. Get some more rods, but I think we're gonna call this an episode for now. And in the next episode, we'll go get more of those rods and see if we can craft 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 ourselves another. And let's try to, since that item we got really isn't this right here really isn't um, much better than we had. But we can't upgrade it later. Let's just try to sell it for now. Let's see how much we can sell it for. I don't know what we can... I mean, I guess we can try something ridiculous for now and see see what it sells for. Why not? Um, let's try to sell another one of these. I think we did sell this before. Yeah, 100. Let's get rid of these twigs here. We don't really need to sell those. Oh, we only had one for sale. Maybe that's why they didn't buy it. Let's just put that there for now. Um, don't want to sell that because that's we only have one of those. Gold runes. I have a feeling we might need that for something. So, uh, and I know we need these steel bars for something. Let's just sell sell one of these. Okay. So I'm curious if we can sell that sword for 500. Let's try that. So let's see if we can sell that, because we can always make more of those swords. If that's the case, we can maybe, uh... See, I don't think the wizard will buy it, but maybe this warrior guy, one of these warrior guys will, or adventurers. Let's see if we get somebody to look at it. So far we haven't got anybody to look at it yet. We have some space here, so I'll have another one of those. Come on, somebody wants the sword. Is that you? No? Nobody's even looking at the sword yet. Come on, you look at the sword. Come on. No? So let's leave the table empty. Maybe they'll look at it then. So we'll just leave those two items on there. 
think this guy will buy it. He looks more like a magic user. All right, this guy will maybe look at it. No, it's like they don't even want to go look at it. All right, let's lower this one. I wonder why nobody's looking at that. Maybe it's just too ridiculously high. Let's go to 400 then. I mean, it could be we just don't have the right person in here. But... I'll try 400. No. So they're standing in line to look at that and they still don't want it. I'm just gonna get rid of everything here and see if they uh, see if they'll look at it now. Apparently, they don't even want to look at that item. Maybe it's maybe it's. A, I would think you can sell it because it allows me to put it there. But nobody's even really wanting to look at it. Interesting. Interesting. They won't even look at it. Are you insulted by my prices? Is that why? Sell it or did he walk away? I think he let me steal it. No, I must have sold it. Nobody wants to even look at that. Okay. So maybe we can't sell that item. What do you think, Mr. Brody? We can't sell the item? Alright, so we're gonna call it a video now and thank you for joining me. It's been Eric from Higher Ground Gaming, and again in the next episode. We're going to try to go adventuring in our dungeon and uh, see if we can make ourselves some, uh, we'll find some more of those iron bars and, and uh, craft another item there. So take care, God bless, and we will see you in the next video. Bye-bye now.